What happened to Danny Kfi out there up at turn three? Whoa. Too much minimum speed. Round she goes. That's always a concept my brain struggles with, that too much minimum speed. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. A Renault, and I think Ricardo. that's Danny Ricardo has gone rather extensively into the tyre barrier and they have red flagged the session. So here we go. Oh, he was uh, already out of shape. He was committed. Apex, wasn't he? Committed. So he's, it... he's turned in there, Paul, and the car's just gone. Yeah, it's nothing to do with where he's positioned. Just if you carry too much speed there and you lose the rear. I was actually, when we were walking the track on Wines with JB, I said exactly the same thing. You lose it early, just watch. Whoa. I did exactly the same thing in DTM. Yeah. About five, six years ago. Alex Albon has stopped and his car has parked up. <laughs> he was fortunate actually when he got going there. He managed to spin it back around and on he goes. So let's just see if he gets the understeer he's talking about. Oh, he's just carried too much speed in. Oh, Alex Albon, what have you done? So it's a big trip into the gravel, and he's actually facing the wrong way, as you can see. He's gone over those big yellow curbs as well, hasn't yeah. he? Yeah, did he just clout a curb and it throw him offline? Or did he just lose it in the same way Danny Rick just lost it Is and it? had no chance to recover? This session's so interesting, like it was last year, wasn't it, when it was hot? And in the yeah. afternoon, it just gets tricky to get around, but those are some nice flat spots. Look, his foot's firmly buried into the brake there, and a horrible sound when you're going through the, the gravel, but the rake in that car obviously let him drive back out. But Stroll has found pace to go eighth fastest. Perez still at the bottom five. No, oh, and that's it for Antonio Giovinazzi, as across the grass he goes, and into the armco he goes. Has he kept the engine going, though? It, he has, and he can rejoin the track. There he goes. Picks up the throttle too hard on the kerb, steers into the slide, front axle bites, and you're suddenly heading off uh, to the left instead. And that then, there was debris on the track, but eventually it was the entire car, or what was left of it, on the track. Science goes up to third. On the grid at the moment is a car pitting Sebastian Vettel. Oh, and Verstappen's lost it at the final corner. So pole position and the chance of it goes away from Max Verstappen right at the final corner. They're all keeping out of trouble so far, apart from the two Ferraris. Sebastian Vettel and Charles Leclerc made contact. Rear wing broken then on that looked like Leclerc's Ferrari. Both Ferraris trying to fight over the same piece of tarmac in turn three. Dives down the inside as Vettel gets squeezed a bit. Well, and that's I, he wasn't he wasn't hit from behind. That was just three into three into one doesn't go basically. We can go racing again. Let's get back to the battle out in front. Hamilton for Verstappen, Science, Bottas, Albon, Ocon, Ricardo is made up a place at the expense of Gasly, Norris, Stroll, and Russell. And Somebody's someone's off. gone wide. It's a Williams or it's an Alpha Towery, but someone's gone wide. It's George Russell. It's George Russell that's gone wide, and he's now down into 18th place. And I wonder if there was contact between himself and Kevin Magnussen. It's Hamilton from Bottas, from Verstappen. Now Sergio Perez having a go, and Alex Albon, oh my lord, that very nearly ended in total disaster. Here's Verstappen at the end of the lap. He's, oh, oh, another spin. What was that you were saying about the Red Bull car? We've seen a lot of spins this year, and it just detaches itself and seems very easy to, to, to let go. There's that bump I'm on about. Nothing, you could just hear the tyre screeching before it kind of got there. This is what happened to Latifi, we saw him going the wrong way, he's had a spin. Same as Max earlier, isn't it? I mean, you are going into a tailwind there though, if the wind is blowing tailwind down to turn one. Yeah. As you get through that corner, the wind's not going to be helping you. That's what we're going to see from, from the cars, you know, they squirming around, look, oh, the back end's out. Oh, 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 oh dear. dear, that's... Uh, that is... The That's weekend goes wanted. from bad to worse for Max Verstappen on the way to the grid into the into uh, the barrier. Uh, the oh, Johnny! Yeah, it's gone. You see the wheels gone. I think. I hit the wall. Uh, copy, Max. And not very easy, and not very wise. Nicholas the TV spinning, and he's got a puncture as well. Oh dear. 
That is Nicholas Latifi, George Russell's teammate, who had a puncture after an unsafe release and was spun around at turn one and, and has gone onto the runoff area at turn five. And I see he might have had a spin there as well, if there's any damage to the car. Uh, yes, that Nicholas. was the spin for Latifi. Yeah. It's, it's turned in, looks like quite late into the corner.